Up a lazy river where the old mill ran Meets a lazy river in the noonday sun Linger in the shade of What's happening? Welcome to the channel. My name is Kevon the Golden, and today we will be watching Abbott Elementary Season 3, Episode, I think it's one and two. I think they dropped a whole little special today, and they counted as episode one and two, called Career Day. Um, We had Career Day at school a few times. Um, the ones I remember is the ones they were used to have in like the auditorium or the gym room. Everybody would have their own booth or stand. The people who come for career day and they'll teach you like this is some of the cool shit I do at my job. Maybe maybe you should want to do this too, type shit. So I've been to a couple of career days. Some of them they, they can be pretty fun. I'm not even gonna lie to y'all. They're not boring at all. If they come with some cool shit, uh, yeah. Um, I fucking love Abbott Elementary. Uh, I love this show. I've been waiting on a show like this for years. You know, a black show that don't involve drugs or killing each other. That's entertaining. And this is one. This is a TV show that I would suggest to people. Um, that's very entertaining, very funny. My favorite character on the show got to be probably Janine because she is so fucking hilarious. She kind of quirky and awkward, and I like that. And so I just stopped wasting time and jump into this episode because I've been waiting on this season for a while, and I can't wait anymore. And also, remember to always watch the original content before watching mine. Yeah, what it do, camera crew? Welcome back to the house of the Ava Bill. We this back. Y'all ain't missing anything. Hey, I got it, you guys. Hey, oh, sorry. Damn, I'm back on Greg. Look, I don't want to say I told you so, but I will. Y'all should have listened to Jacob and made a right on 30th Street instead of the left that night. You want me to tell you why? So they got robbed because they thought it'd be cute to walk around West Philly at night with all this camera equipment. Hey, a lot of help rob you if I was there. <laughs> anyway, here we are five <clears throat> months later because that's how long it takes for three people with art degrees to save up for new cameras. Got their ass fucked over. It's career day today. Ava. <laughs> what the fuck, Ava? <laughs> the district has been more annoying than usual. They're not all bad. I think they're cool. Mm -hmm. Not bad. Not bad, bad too. Good morning, Abbott Elementary. Good morning, Abbott Elementary. So, yeah. <laughs> Sleep, Martha. You guys missed a lot. Five months earlier. Good day to the fine teachers of Abbott Elementary. What? Look directly at <laughs> Gregory being F-O-I-N-1. No. Uh, hi. Hi, everybody. Uh, we're from the school district. Uh, Principal Coleman invited us to come. Yes. The importance of collaboration is one of the many things I learned while I was matriculating at Cambridge. Yeah, nah, shit. I went to Harvard this summer. do a feature. I sat right there on their campus and I used their free Wi-Fi to get my degree in education via Education Connection. And I've learned what it actually takes to do the job of principal. And <laughs> turns out this I shit, I... wrong. <laughs> Gregory, we still need you to read from Section A. There is your binder. Um, Section A. Welcome back. That concludes section A. Thank you, Mr. Eddie. That's Maybe. deep. Does anyone have any ideas from over the summer that they'd like to implement? Are hey. you chucking and jabbing? <laughs> oh my God. I think we should do career day at the school because I checked and we haven't had one since the only jobs for women were typists, moms, and wet nurses. And I, but I'm just going to go ahead and say no and say. You're just going to shut it down like that? You know, this is not that was a great idea. Like, what the fuck? I have a lot of time trying to fight the odds. Principal Coleman over there, you guys are so lucky. You have such a good principal. Yes. Yeah, they do. A little early for this. No. A husband sets it near an outlet. Well, a booty call put it down wherever I want him to, so don't make it. <laughs> no. I'll put that bitch wherever. Are you at JT215? Yes. And add JT267 when I want to spice up the Discord. Miss T's, I'm not ready for Gregory, you better watch out. You're going to TYB your ass, boy. I love you. So low stakes, high reward improvement. Yes, let's revisit that. Are you okay? Yeah. 
just a lot of positive reinforcement. <laughs> Ava, I've already told you I'm not going to know how to take all that. For the golden. I'm little Jonathan, and I never learned how to make direct eye contact with anyone, and so now they call me Shifty Eye Johnny, and I can't hold down a job. All right, <laughs> I will take that into account. What does this got to do with it? You must. Oh, there is a 10 for 10 sale with the school supply, by the way. Oh, yes. Trying out cursing. What the fuck? I was lost for it. Ah, uh, later, Patrick, Kentucky Bluegrass, right? The whole place. So flat. Damn, that nigga. What'd you do over the break? Geek the same. I spent a lot of time with myself the brunchy bunch. Why not just the brunch bunch? That's good. <laughs> It's just not working for me, is it? Not quite, what curse okay. words are you using? I heard about uh, Miss Cheeks. Could I speak with you quick, one on one? Sorry to interrupt. No, all good. Yeah, sure. Are you going to call me Janine? Okay, Janine. Yeah. Yeah, so, nigga. I was talking. There's this fellowship, uh, the Robeson Fellowship at the district. We want somebody with infield experience to come enhance what the district can do to make schools as efficient as possible. It sounds like I had you in mind for it. Oh. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> she is really trying these curse words out. <laughs> Worked the district for a little while. Something about a fellowship. Oh my god, the ropes and fellowship. Of the rain? This is a huge deal, Janine. You can't be away from my classroom for that long. I'm gonna cry just thinking about it. You actually, you actually are crying. We ain't gotta do it. Damn, Janine. That is video contraband. Well, my job. Curriculum. Most teachers do. Day, you know, they get paid like shit. Work. They love their job. You know, and because of the damn school system, because of the kids. The only reason they taking that shit is the fucking low ass paycheck budget they giving them teachers. Wait, that's my Lucky. Last year's ain't been with a roast for you, but looking like Adam Sandler at a pickup game. Adam Sandler at a wedding. Adam Sandler at the Oscars. Why she roasting them? You just come to school the first day having your friends were roasting your ass. Right. This will roast 7%. Damn. Right. We you in charge? You didn't do a pre-charge? And we only have two chargers. The cherry ring yep, this is a black school. <laughs> no, I do not. I do not know of one man who would ask his girlfriend's friend for her correct ring size as a joke. Basically, <laughs> why are you in the now? <laughs> Made me replace my mouth water. The best stuff is like a side door star. The older it is, the better it gets. All right, let's, let's I don't start. think that's how it goes. <laughs> there are no more free periods. Instead, everyone will be volunteering for lunch duty, home monitoring, library management, etc. at all times. Damn. Got their ass on a ball and chain. And no more off campus lunches. It's against policy. Motherfucker. She's actually becoming good at her job. <laughs> Listen, speaking of, could you look into getting a McFlurry machine for my classroom? Because do that. Typical. <laughs> you say, damn the man. Hey, you know, leapfrog tablets could be better. Ooh, yes. The bill for student use more cost efficient. Is they job just saying yes? Yes. Once Fuck yeah, once right on, bro. Really? Yeah. <laughs> and I, I don't want to sell money hungry, but it's here. Hey, Reese. Two dollars. Two dollars? That's like a million dollars. <laughs> well, you know what? <laughs> yeah, if she says no. Yeah, if she says no, you gotta, you gotta find somebody else, right? Damn, you were listening to all that? The legendary Mrs. Howard. I haven't had a chance to connect with you yet, but I hear you're the one. Charmed. Didn't even shake his hand, fuck nigga. <laughs> get I started working at the district because I saw that it needed to change for students. Like the student that I was, for teachers like you, and for teachers like my mom. You need to run for president. Your mom's an educator. You know how to bullshit anybody. I listen to her. <laughs> yeah, he's gonna backdoor the fuck out of everybody at the end of the season. So we decided to tempt her with things we know she loves. First, money. We said Jacob and Oh, oh shit. Second, we <laughs> love a skip and work. And then, <laughs> for an usher show. Nothing is working. You said you don't want to get serenaded. Now we're pulling out the bit. Ready? Oh, oh, come on. We cannot stand any more of this. You, Ava. You finna have to be a piece of meat right now, nigga. We need off site lunch breaks, motherfucker. Come on. Do you want to continue? Take it off. Take off the sweater. <laughs> Hush. Jesus, a pimp. Do you want to continue? Take it off. Take off the sweater. Hush. Jesus, a pimp. Do you want to continue? Take it off. Take off the sweater. Hush. Jesus, a pim
Yeah. Bob got all that pink and purple on. She got a backhand in his ass. Well, it depends. All these rules, all these rules are so <laughs> hard. Rigid. Well, well. <laughs> Please. I feel like a whore. <laughs> I lead now. I communicate. I haven't listened to the city girls in months. Damn, she's really grown up. There's one card we can play, but we're gonna have to go low. Nay, get low. Hmm? What you mean, Barbara? I ain't never seen that. <laughs> I've got to go save the school. <laughs> what? What? she plotting now? Yeah, there's a bunch of teachers in there saying Princeton's better than Harvard. Oh, hell no! <laughs> Ava said she stopped listening to the town women, so yes. but I know there's one song she cannot resist. What song? Jacob Johnson, let go of your butt. Let go of your butt. <laughs> Oh my gosh, she put a bat that ass up. Come on, Ava. Come on, let it take over for the 99 nine in the 2000. Oh, gee, hot girl, right there. Damn, like that. Damn, right there. And I'm going to miss my students. Like, right, 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 right. What about us? Damn, President Day, this shit getting interesting, nigga. Oh, hell yeah, something weird is going on between Gregory and Janine. <laughs> Did he tell you? Well, lucky for y'all, my hidden cameras picked up everything. Hidden cameras? <laughs> you dirty <laughs> motherfucker. What are the chances they all got robbed? <laughs> <laughs> got their ass mean mug, nigga. <laughs> Man, she come shoot that motherfucker? Uh, uh, wow. Um, this is what you want, right? You gonna say yes? In my mind, in my mind I kind of put a period on that. Damn. Out of respect, feels like it would be safer mm -hmm. for both of us mm -hmm. if we were just friends. Yeah, you, you turned her down. Yeah. You know, definitely. Because I really value right. this to get. Yeah. You know what I mean? I get it. I really, yeah. It's going to be weird for having that. Look at Janine's face. <laughs> 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 wow. Janine's will be quiet. Uh, okay. Um, so, for you, Mrs. Kirby and Anesthesia, requested you have Mr. Johnson. Yeah. He's had, like, every job under the sun. Very Mr. Johnson? Gig economy. Oh, the places will go. Um... I, I want to see that one. Mr. Eddie, but we're on the same page because, like, here, you know I don't want to get married again. Uh, come on. I'm in like, front of the camera. Yeah, I guess. I guess. You can talk about this off screen. All right. So, okay. This shit colder than a banker's heart, nigga. And then, I see why they're being weird. She put the date on the bottom of the board instead of the top. Classic mistake. Let me just. No, no, no. We don't come in there correcting <laughs> shit. Oh, and I like to fight. Well, y'all gonna say, Grandma gonna whoop your ass. I brought a fake slaw. Really? That's what you brought? So, what I do is make a little palm tree on the forehead. About the weirdest and animal I ever. Know I know all kinds of fruit trees close together that can lead to cross pollination. Sorry. We already knew that just shit. You know, Why didn't y'all just have him do it? Come on now. You ain't gotta be clowning like that. I got myself on the ballot, and the rest is history. Anyway, I served three terms, and we won the Cold War. So then I come over here, and I create a... Why was you president then, nigga? <laughs> That's why I've arranged a special guest to come say... Ah, hi. shit. I think you might like him more. They got some star power. I mean... Hey, little girl, look at you. I dressed up for career day. <laughs> <laughs> Good one, Jalen Hurts. It's a clown to... This makes me want to never work. All right, that's dramatic. Damn, yeah, you saying all that, little nigga? Hey, I got a crazy favor to ask you. Ready for kickoff. Oh, my God. District 3? Absolutely. Okay. One, it's so lame. Two, three. 
<laughs> Thanks. Thank you, Ava. <laughs> I think you can give us like 10 minutes so we can put you in every classroom. For the kids, I got all the time in the world. As long as it's wrapped up in 10 minutes, I got to get the practice. Thank you. Your face is incredible. That's not all the time in the world. <laughs> oh, my gosh. Found the solution. No kids or professionals feel left out, and Jalen meets every class. There's a special someone who wants to propose because this love feels like the first time. <laughs> he did it now. Oh, my God. God. Please don't say no. Please don't say no. This and motherfucker's going to jump off a bridge. Don't say no. To be part of the proposal. Somebody love got to work this season, God damn it. Remind me. Please don't say no. Please don't say no. Don't make him look like a goddamn jabroni. No. Oh, <laughs> damn. She took him down. Damn. Jabroni drive. <laughs> I think maybe you should take this outside because everyone's watching and I don't think you want this. Yeah, this yeah, is really okay. embarrassing. Well, uh, Miss Schmendy's. Yeah, I mostly work on Sundays. <laughs> Black ass really nigga. Funny. We're breaking up. I hate to say it, but I think so. Welcome, Tyrone. You're going to get hit by a bus. Ava hasn't given me any office space. Well, this is my mom's office, and we're about to have an important meeting. Damn, who are you meeting with? <laughs> well, I do watch a lot of Whose Line Is It Anyway. <laughs> it's usually with What is Ray. that? Great! <laughs> <Right? laughs> I know! <laughs> Ooh, this look is a slay, Mrs. Howard. Oh, she found some real Ray friends. Hey, baddie. Gerald? Honey, grab your gators, because we are going out. Oh, ah, shit, out. they stepping in the name of love oh, tonight, man. nigga. Chatting about our days. Oh my god, me too. Like earlier with Melissa and Gary, she yeah. said no to him in front of the Eagles. I just wanted to tell you immediately. <sighs> that nigga going to sleep with a gun yeah. in his mouth tonight. Yeah. That shit. <laughs> That's shit rough. Yeah. I only left because I wanted to try working for the district. That was it. So what you good at that? Under a tarp. They had the audacity to try and whack me. Damn, he was in the mafia now? Making sure I for those goons. I left Sicily, officially became an American citizen, and landed here. Are you the godfather? Until I picked up this mop and never looked back. I still can't look at Tortellini the same. Anyway, did you come from not believing? You work is self explanatory. You see me around, you know what I do. About a bone, we the baddest guy in the room. How you doing? That was an amazing little first episode special they did i like they went for like a 40 minute special some sitcoms when they get deep to the season they used to do that and i like this for them a whole little career day special it was pretty funny um i guess this is not going to be a season for love at all um the dude that got turned down in front of the Eagles, man. I just feel so bad for the guy. <laughs> you get turned down not only in front of the Eagles, but in a school for the kids, for the black kids. At that, they can be roasting the fuck out of you. You're going to be the topic for like two, one or two days. One or two days, you can be like the topic. Like, motherfucker's going to be on your ass. <laughs> <laughs> in front of the Eagles, though, like, God damn it, you asked them to do this and you got turned down. <sighs> she could have, I wish she would have started off like, can we talk about this offside? Like, God damn. Just a no. <laughs> like, God damn it. In the Janine and Gregory situation, it's just like Jim and Pam. They're going to be together eventually. Because, like, okay, I get it's a sitcom, but they are kind of frequent and consistent with they with their lore and stuff like that. So, why would you waste multiple seasons and not put them together? But I know they're going to be together. Give it around end of this season or season four, they're going to be together. But, and then it becomes, what do you do after that? I feel like... This is a real good show, and I hope they got a lot of more material left than just, you know, relationships and stuff like that. Because it is a school, and there's a lot of funny things you can do at a school. We haven't even seen 
any like sports teams at this school yet. So I know Mr. Johnson make a perfect coach or something like that. He funny as hell. I love Mr. Johnson. Apparently his ass not only a janitor, he had so many jobs. He was a janitor. He was in the mob. Apparently he was president somewhere. I don't know. King. We'll never know. <laughs> But yeah, it was a pretty good episode and a pretty good career day. Um, we never really got any celebrities to come to our school. We just a random ass school in Chicago. Ain't nobody was coming to our school. Um, but yeah, we did have some career days though, where we would have some people with some very interesting jobs. You know, scientists and. People from the army, and you have um, doctors and people like that. And it was pretty fun. You know, it had some things and activities you can do there. It was pretty interesting. Um, but yeah, they came out strong. I really like this episode. Hope the rest of the season can be consistent. I'm really fucking with it. Thanks for watching, everybody. Remember to like and subscribe. It's a bright new morning, we can loaf along blue skies above, and everyone's in love up the lazy river.